Hello crafting buddies. Here I am, Wilma, Ermelo the Netherlands again, in my conservatory, sun going down in the west. Really in the west, no more north as we used to as we had, you know, in the summer. Nice warm day, 23 degrees again, and I've been sitting outside making this. And I want to share my excitement. That's what I hear my especially the American crafters they get excited and sometimes they over excite me um a bit more down to earth as the british usually are stiff off a lip as well sorry i'm i think i'm using all these cliches and uh, generalizations <laughs> maybe i shouldn't now i want to share with you the fact that i've come across oh, already some time ago Two ladies live in Britain and they are called, they call themselves and their Etsy shop, shop Chapter One Papers. Now, um, Angela Kerr sometimes shows things that they produced and this is one of their latest uh, makes and uh, I'm, I'm a fan. And what I'm going to show you is, let's first, I'll just show you, just to give you an impression. I This is actually A4 size. Oh, by the way, talk about A4. I think this is the only Etsy shop now that does all their things, and that has taken them a lot of time, in A4 and in US letter size. So if you print off... Uh, if you print it in, in your printer, then you get your full picture. So when I print the American letter size, I always, you know, I'm always left with part of my uh, space. It's, it's Well, you know, it's not a big deal. I'm not complaining. But somehow this is just very thoughtful, don't you think? Well, I print off in, I print in, um, in A4 size since that is common here. And this I did half the size, so A5, so I have two on one paper. Well, that depends on what I'm going to use it for. By the way, I print, this time I printed on cream, Clairefontaine 160 uh, grams paper. Clairefontaine is, is uh, EU, It's I think it's French, I'm not sure, it sounds French. But this is ivory cream colour, not the very, very white, because then I usually have to um, make it, um, put more ink on. And uh, this this already has the atmosphere. Look, I already, this, these are some um, embellishments and ephemera. And this is an A4 size paper, which I think is, a, whoa, sorry. <laughs> It's astonishing. It's beautiful. So what did I do? Now I used um, three envelopes. Mm, it's a bit like something I learned. It's a copper clip. Something um, I saw on one of the tutorials by Angela Kerr. Only something happened and I decided not to let it interfere with my plans because something just tore off. Now this happens, doesn't it, ladies? And I don't want I don't want to waste things. So I thought, how am I going to solve this? And I'll show you. This is my back page. There are a few of these labels, purple labels in there. I fussy cut some of the page and put it onto uh, purple paper. This purple paper, by the way, is the only thing I used that was not chapter one because I wanted something very purple and this was from my porch prints. Now these are lilacs and wisteria and it's absolutely beautiful. Here are, of course, lavender. Um, I used uh, some some lilac-y colour and some uh, applications. I, I back, oh, actually, I printed a back page. This is one of the pages that comes with a kit, which is a bit grey, purple, and very neutral. I mean, you can write on it, which is not what you can say of this purple. So, um, and that is here. Um, is there anything I can say here? No, I don't think so. Oh, there's, this is a, one of the, again, this is one of the cards. 
um, this is a larkspur, larkspur, which is in Dutch ridderspoor. A lark being a bird in English. I am learning things from this, you know, I am. No, this is the double page. This is one of the envelopes and I opened it here. And this also, this is actually a journaling card, but it's also a full page. Uh, so you get it as a, a quarter of a page and a whole page. And again, this is the back. I put um, this little round thing is also part of these uh, um, embellishments. Okay, a pocket, a journaling card, some lovely, lovely, um, um, beautiful what? <laughs> tags, I'm sorry. Um, this is Monix Cup. Now, I don't know that word in English, but I love my garden and I know a lot. Irises, again, wisteria, very pretty. But this one, I don't know the name of. Yes, lavender, campanula, I think that is. But we're not doing a plant course, botanical. Uh... Okay, I made a tuck spot here. Now, there I go. This is a pretty envelope. This is part of the kit again. And I put something, I put one of the cards, one of the journaling cards in here. I just folded it so it fitted in. Oh, I love this. Look at that wildflower. This is the cornflower, Centauria. Beautiful. What am I doing wrong? Okay, there we go. I... I made a tag, but I made it in such a way that it still shows that little flower because I, I like the idea. There, I kept the irises, so I sort of planned it. Here is a little... I This is actually a, um, a pocket like that one, only here I cut it out till here because I just like the fussy cutting. Very pretty page. And here is my disaster. I've had to use washi tape. Um, to put it back together again because somehow the paper just started tearing and I didn't want to stop. Look at this pretty place. This is the Larkspur, also a pocket where you can put something. I printed it double-sided. Here it is. Lovely. Now, and then you turn it round and you get two of these. And this is where I... Um, I sewed all around and here you get two of these very pretty uh, tags again only they were longer than I wanted so I folded it made a little pocket at the back and I put the pretty stamps the postage stamps which they created in the back you see and this fits in here I'm not going to do that because I usually get in trouble so I'm a bit of a, a bit of a coward. You see, here's the cornflowers, lovely, and you, there are um, butterflies everywhere too. I put three postage stamps in here, which were in the kit. Okay, now here are the. This is one of the um, one of the pages, or part of the pages, and here is the other one, which I of course. Now, here's the washi tape. Try to get it colour coordinated. Um, here is a pocket I've made of a journaling card. These are pansies. And look at this. Isn't it pretty? So beautiful. This is also a big A4 sized page, which you can use in a journal. And this is the inside again. Okay. Here is one of the postage stamps. And here, ha ha, ta da, is also what is one page. I put a flower in there as a kind of tab, as a kind of a tab to uh, just to pull this out. I put some um, page, old page behind it, and uh, well, let's just leave it that way. So I had a lot of fun, and I think what these girls make. I want to give them my compliments because it is absolutely quality. Thanks for watching again, folks.
I hope you, if you want, I mean, I'll, I'll in the box in the box down below, I'll link this uh, this kit. And I would also like to ask you to su subscribe to my channel if you like what I do. And I have some previous videos which you can still watch if you like. Okay, thanks for watching and uh, have a good start of next week. Bye.